There's a brand new free skin everyone can unlock that's unreleased and you can get it in Fortnite Creative apparently and I'm going to be checking that out during today's video so if you want to see how to get the secret unreleased skin make sure you watch this video until the very end without skipping through. And really quickly as you know Fortnite Chapter 4 is just around the corner and we're going to be getting a brand new battle pass so if you want a chance of getting yourself that battle pass for completely free drop a like, subscribe, turn on those notifications and make sure you're active to the channel because once the brand new season drops i'm going to be gifting out a bunch of battle passes to my subscribers so just make sure you're ready for that let me know that you dropped a like and are subscribed in the comment section down below and without further ado let's go ahead and check out this brand new life hack and creative to get your hands on a secret unreleased skin this is absolutely crazy and i just seen this for the very first time so let's go ahead and check it out as you can see here on screen there's a few things we got to go ahead and do so let's check it out right here so as you guys can see we got to use the thermal flopper we got to use the junk rift and then also the shadow bomb i'm pretty sure and then from there we got to go into the secret phone booth and then you'll come out as this secret unreleased skin that's not in Fortnite Battle Royale. So as you can see, the we gotta use the Thermal Fish, the Junk Rift, and then the Shadow Bomb. We gotta go straight into the locker before the Junk Rift hits the ground. And then as you guys can see, I haven't seen that skin in Fortnite Battle Royale. It looks pretty cool, not gonna lie. So without further ado, let's go ahead and do this right now. It's, there's a few simple steps to go ahead and follow along and uh, it, it should be pretty easy to go ahead and do. So basically the first thing I gotta do is load up into a creative match. So let me go over to creative just like this. And then from here, all I gotta do is, well, let me go ahead and pick creative. That didn't pick it, but there we go. Creative mode. Let me go ahead and click on play just like this and we got to load up into a creative match now pretty much anyone can go ahead and do this if you have creative available on your fortnite which most of you guys do basically all of you guys do you can go ahead and test out this life hack as well with me but make sure you watch this video until the end to see if this actually works or not but as you can see i'm now in a creative match and what i need to do is head into my very own island so i gotta head over to this rift not over there but to this rift right here and as you guys can see i gotta head into my very own island which is right here so let me just go through into my island as you can see and basically from here, you can hear uh, Gingy freaking out on my back. But as you guys can see, we gotta go ahead and come over this way. And basically what I need to go ahead and do is go into my inventory. Now, I don't play creative too often, so this might be a little bit hard, but as you guys can see, it, it's definitely gonna be doable. So let me go over to devices. I assume this is where the phone booth is at. So let me try to find the phone booth right now so the phone booth should be somewhere around here if i haven't already passed it let me continue going through as you guys can see we got the golf carts a lot of uh really cool items here but here is the changing booth let me go ahead and place this right now and there we go i got a few changing booths so let me go ahead and place this just like that boom there we go we should be good to go now what i also need is one second let me go back into my inventory and let me go to consumables. I'm pretty sure this is where I can find the, um, or actually, you know what? I may have to go over to weapons to find the shadow bombs. I'm pretty sure. Let me go ahead and go all the way down just like this. So maybe it's, it's actually not there. Let me go ahead and look through the consumables as well. So basically I got to find myself the junk rift the shadow bomb and also the thermal fish so here's some thermal fish is uh, let me just go ahead and equip a bunch of those we got the midas flopper right there too let me go ahead and go down we got some shadow bombs right there as well and then i also got to use the junk rift which is right here so let me go ahead and use some junk rifts i think i have some there we go so i have all the loot i currently need so let me go ahead and rewatch to see the method. I gotta use everything basically in a certain pattern. So let me just make sure that I do that correctly. 
So let me rewatch this. So basically I gotta eat the thermal fish, throw down the junk rift, and then the shadow bomb, and then head into the locker. All right, it's pretty simple. Let's go ahead and do that right now. Let's get this secret unreleased skin here in Fortnite Battle Royale. And I'm gonna try to do this all in one take pretty much. Let me line everything up properly. So thermal fish, junk rift, and then the shadow bomb. So let me go ahead, throw this on. Boom, let me go ahead and toss this. I tossed a few of them by accident, but it should work anyways. And as you guys can see, it's actually not letting me in the phone booth for some odd reason. All right, so in order for the phone booth to work, I think I actually gotta start the game. So that's one thing I did mess up on. Let me go ahead and start the match, and now I can actually use the phone booth. Now, like I mentioned before, I don't really uh, play creative and play uh, you know, on my creative island too often, so I'm not too familiar with this, but I've started the game, so now it should allow me to go inside of my changing booth, as you guys can see. So before I start up the match, I basically just gotta draw all of the items here at this location so let me go ahead and do this one more time so I got to head over to the thermal fishes just like this and now I got to get this shadow bombs as well and then also the junk rifts just like that so let me go ahead and drop all this loot here just like this boom and boom there we go, we should be good. Now I can go ahead and start the match and I should have all the loot available for me once the match has officially started, as you can see right here. So now I just gotta head down to this location where the phone booth is at, of course. And then from here, I just gotta do the method one more time. So let me grab the thermal fish, just like that, the junk rift, and then also the shadow bomb. So let's go ahead and do this. Let's factor cap this. The changing booth is working. So let's go ahead and throw on the thermal fish. Toss down this junk rift. Shadow bomb. Boom. And I made it into the locker. So let me go ahead and back out. And I should have a secret unreleased skin as shown here on screen. And as you guys can see, my character and my skin is like, you know, pretty much the same. Now, one thing I did notice is... The person that was showcasing this tutorial was a default skin. So let me put on no skin. Let me equip on no skin just like this. Let me back out of the phone booth because maybe I have to be a default skin in order for this to work. And now, as you can see, I'm a default skin. Let me go ahead and try this one more time. Let me throw this on. Let me use the junk rift, shadow bomb, boom. And I just made it in time. I made it in time. Let's see if this works right here, right now. So let me go ahead and back out of the phone booth. And as you guys can see, well, this method was a cap. The skin does look pretty cool, but yeah, it doesn't work. Either way, I tested it out, so you don't have to. Click one of these videos on screen. Thank you so much for watching till the end. I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.